so guys in order to deploy the, uh, our model first you need a account of a azure okay so you can sign up uh, you will get uh, some free credits okay for free tags so let's uh, start with creating resource group first so i'll click on this after that i will click on create so i will select here subscription as free trial and uh, i will give some resource name here so i have given here name as uh, youtube text embedding resource okay and uh, i will use here a uh, central india okay so asia specific central india i have selected here next uh, review and click create just uh, click on create button so congratulations your uh, resource has created now search here open ai okay and click on this now click on create azure open ai so here you need to select the resource so i have created here youtube text embedding resource after that i will select the same region okay let us take any region so i will take this one the default only okay and i will give here some name like uh, text embedding I will just take a stand so okay so I'll change the name to my model now just I will click on next I'll make the same uh, I'll not change anything in networks okay I'll leave it as default click on next then next next click on create so guys you can see our model is deploying a uh, resource is creating okay so i will click on this uh, go to resource so guys you can see uh, there is a resource manager so there is a key and in points okay and i will click on this model deployments and click on this manage deployments so here it is saying welcome to azure AI open ai studio so i will select the plan as uh, free trial and i will select the resource as my model okay just which we have created and use this resource i have clicked on this now i will come down so here it is saying that create a new deployment so i will click on this now create a new deployment now uh, give any name so i will give here text embedding So it is saying to select the model. So I will select here model as uh, text embedding ADA 002. Okay, or you can use small also. It depend on your choice. So for now I will use any from this anyone. Uh, let me take it as uh, large. Okay. So it will be standard, and I'll. Make the limit to 350 now. Okay, and click on create. So guys, you can see here it is successfully created deployment. Okay, so I'll click on this now. So from here you can edit the deployments and delete the deployments. Okay. So for now I will go to deployments now. So guys, I will come back here and in order to uh, use this, uh, that model, just we have to use this access key, region and in point, okay. So guys, in order to get the access key for this, I will click on this switch to new version, okay. So guys, so this is the new version. In the deployments, uh, it is our deployed 
text embedding model okay i'll click on this so you can see here it is our uh, endpoint and this is our key okay so from here this we can access so let's try this in postman test whether it is working or not okay so guys i was now in the postman i have uh, pasted the url here and with the post method and in the body i have selected raw json and i have given this input and model name okay this url i have copied from uh, here and this access key i have copied okay and in the headers i have given api key and this value i have given okay this whatever the key was there i have pasted here and thus i have given here hello world and the model name as okay from where i have taken the model name so from here i have copied the model name also okay so i will click on send now so you can see in the body json we have got the embeddings okay so this embedding we will store in the database so everything is fine is working now let's start creating database now 